Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. And here we have Manchester against Monaco. Well, I'm Peter Drury and I'm joined in the commentary box by the familiar figure of Jim Beglin. Hello, Peter, and hello to everyone watching. For me, it's a, it's a real thrill to be here. Things have got on the way here pretty promptly. And it's Jovetic. Lamar. Jovetic. Can he finish? And it's a goal! And what a great way to start the game, to spark the game. I mean, the captain has basically triggered a contest that should be even livelier than we anticipated. Get your seatbelts on. This could be rather exciting. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front, and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. Manchester trail at this early stage. How will they respond? Falcao. Just brushed off the ball there. This could fall anywhere. Falcao has a hit. Falcao explosive. 2-0, and they're already threatening to run riot. Oh, high-quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. Monaco can have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Falcao hits it! More and more and more and more! They are running riot! And they are disappearing out of sight! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. He snaffles his third and that earns him the match ball. Well, he's been the outstanding player on the pitch and devastating in front of the goal. What a display, what a player. Monaco take a three-goal lead and they are romping out of sight. And it's Keita. Fabinho. Jovetic passes it through. He's got options out wide. Goalkeeper's ball. Silva. So what now? Looks like a good ball through. Giamutinho. And it's Keita. Lamar. Some good play on the left-hand side now to profit from it. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Time to deliver. Can he put it away? Oh, the keeper's done just about enough. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. Great leap! Oh, surely this time... It's one! It's bounced out! It's there! Hot knife through butter! They have done it again! Keita at his razor-sharp best there. Well, for me, that's just pure predatory brilliance. It's not so much the finish, but the way he read the situation when nobody else was even alert to it. It's fantastic. Monica. Big chance! Falcao explosive! All too easy! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight! Listen, when you're on an invitation to improve your goal difference, why he's off? Four in the game, he is the man. 
Monaco tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. Falcao. It's got. He's gone for it. Oh, almost a sixth. Monaco are looking quite mean on the counter, and combating that requires even more meanness. Forward it goes. Fabinho. Looks to slip it through. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Silva. Tries to get it forward quickly. Well won, that's good play. And it's Jovetic. Out wide to the right. Going through. Falcao hits it! It's a goal! And already they're looking to run away with it. It's part of the game, Peter. It has to get ruthless. Sympathy just doesn't play a part. How many more does he want? Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. That's good progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? Oh, good ball. The shot's on! Oh, and with that, the half-time whistle goes. Fantastic excitement towards the end of the half there and a last-minute chance that really should have been converted. Here we go again, then. Manchester now need to set about their task very professionally. If they do, then the chances will come, and from there, the focus will zoom in on their finish. In with a header! No, no way through there. And he heaves it forward. Joao Moutinho. Looking to break out here. Sane with the ball through. He's left his man. Aguero. He'll have a dip. Aimed long and direct. Keita. And the counter is on. And it's Jovetic. Looks to slip it through. Keita is desperately calling for it out wide. Lamar. Jean Moutinho. Hits one! And through to the goalkeeper. Walker passes it through. Well played, he saw that coming. It's Aguero. De Bruyne tries a through ball. Sané tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Well, the further he went, the more attention he attracted. There was just way too much pressure for him to get the shot away. Aguero. Aguero. 
ball's loose. Who's getting there? To Bruyne. Fabinho just did a brilliant job there. It was one of those all-or-nothing commitments, and he came up trumps. Jean Moutinho. And it's Jovetic. Now the pass goes for goal. And the shot. The Bruin knocks it away. Finish forward, it goes. Silver looks like a good ball through. He's got away, and De Bruyne and he steered it beyond the post. Manchester are really feeling the strain now. Impatience has taken charge. Sterling, it's a loose ball. Jovetic set up one goal so far. Jovetic plays it forward. Going through, all the balls come loose. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Monaco really are defending from the front. They are, and this type of pressing is a, a case of counter-attacking a counter-attack. It's high octane and high pressure, high fitness. Falcao. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Jean Moutinho. Now it's Keita. Falcao. Sare. Oh, they could break here. Tries a through ball. Terence Congolo. Just five minutes remaining now. And that's been won straight back. And it's Keita. Jao Moutinho. Jovetic! Intercepts the throw. It's well read. Silva. Get that clear. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. Manchester thoroughly outclassed here. They came up against opponents who were better in all areas. No argument. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Look, Peter, a strength in any team has to be at the heart of your defence, and I'm afraid they were found wanting in that department. My thanks to Jim. We both wish you a very good evening.